Hello everybody, today I'm going to be showing you how to create a multi-camera source sequence in Adobe Premiere Pro. This feature is very good for when you're editing different camera angles, it just makes it a lot faster and a lot easier. So the very first thing you want to do is import all of your footage into Adobe, I have all mine down here, and then you're just going to want to select all of the clips that you're actually going to use, and then right click. Then you're going to want to press create multi-camera source sequence, which will pop up with this little settings thing, we're just going to go ahead name this real quick and then you're going to want to click audio make sure the track channel is mixed down uh, we're going to keep the sequence present as automatic uh, for the audio sequence setting i'm just going to use camera one which basically just means that all of the audio is going to come from the first camera that i selected uh, but if you want to you can also click all cameras which basically will make adobe line up all of the audio clips and then it'll just automatically line it up for you so you don't have to do that. Uh, we're going to keep audio channels automatic. And then for the camera names, if you, you could just click enumerated cameras, which basically just means that it will automatically label the cameras for you, but mine are already labeled, so I'm just going to say use clip names. After that, you're just going to want to press OK. Now you should see a new source in your media box, so you're just going to click it and drag it, drag it to make a new timeline. It shows up just as one specific source, but it actually has all three cameras in it already. So what we're going to want to do next is click this little plus button and add the multi-camera record on knock toggle and then the toggle multi-camera view. Just going to want to press OK. And then you can click the toggle multi-camera view to show all of your separate cameras. On the right side of the screen, you will see the camera that's actually playing in the video and then the left side is going to have the cameras that you can switch between. So to actually switch between the videos, you're just going to want to press this little red button down here. And then as you play through the video, you're going to click uh, different keys to switch the camera. So the first, the number one, your keyboard is going to be for the first camera, two, second camera, three, third camera. And as you play through the video and you click these buttons, it will automatically change which camera is showing for the actual video. So we're just going to go ahead and press play. If you want to switch to the second camera, you press two. Third camera, press three. First camera, press one. Uh, when you actually stop playing the video, you will see the little, it automatically made the little cuts for where the camera was changed. So you can kind of go through and see. And if you didn't like that, you can uh, just control Z and try again. But yeah, that's, that's basically it. That's how you use a multi-camera source sequence in Adobe.